Investigation into the deaths of two people in Schuylkill County. Their bodies were found early yesterday morning near New Philadelphia. Now, state police have not released the names of the people, but family members have taken to social media posting about the loss of their loved ones. 2822 News I team reporter Andy Mahalshik is working that story. He joins us now live in New Philadelphia with new information. And Andy, I understand you spoke with a family member. Well, that's right, Kaz. I spoke with the aunt of 18-year-old Hunter Mock. Again, state police have not officially confirmed the names of the two bodies, the identities of the two bodies found in a wooded area here near New Philadelphia. But family members have said on social media, and Hunter Mock's aunt said that they were notified yesterday morning. They got the call that he was indeed found dead here, uh, deceased yesterday morning in New Philadelphia. Now, this all began uh, several days ago with missing persons reports issued by state police at Frackville for 18-year-old Hunter Mock and 16-year-old Angelito Carballo. Now, let me show you some video taken today. State police were back at the scene of the wooded area on Ferndale Road, about one mile east of Route 209. We found state troopers. They say the bodies were found yesterday morning at around 3.30 a.m. They were taken there by a witness. They used the word witness. Again, troopers and the coroner not yet identifying officially the bodies, but the family members are taking to social media, and I did speak to the aunt of uh, Hunter Mock, who says they got the call yesterday morning. Here's what Rachel Friendy, the aunt, had to say to me late this afternoon. When we first realized it, it was yesterday morning we got the call. And, you know, it was just like disbelief. It's almost like, no, it, it has to be a mistake. And, you know, it, it wasn't. And, um, you know, it's it's been rough since, you know, because he was so young and since it was, it, it was brutal. Now that is a, coming up is a picture of Hunter Mock again that the state police issued several days ago. He and Carballo went missing on separate days, Sunday and Monday, from their homes here in New Philadelphia. Now we are live here at the Good Intent Fire Company in New Philadelphia. This is a counselors are being placed here. The Pottsville Area School District said counselors are available because Angelito Carballo was a student at the Pottsville High School last year. So counselors are here being offered up to anybody who needs it or anyone in Pottsville. They can reach out to their school counselors to talk about the situation. They use the words, the uh, tragedy in New Philadelphia and the passing of Angelito Carballo. But again, state troopers and the coroner's office have not officially identified the bodies as Carballo and uh, Mock, Hunter Mock, but family members say they did uh, they were notified that they were told they are the bodies of the two deceased found yesterday morning. As far as the investigation, state troopers say it's ongoing. They're asking anybody with any possible information about this case to give the Frackville State Police Barracks a call. It's an active investigation, and tomorrow morning, uh, Dr. Uh, Richard Moyle in the corner here in Schuylkill County says they'll be doing a forensic autopsy on the bodies tomorrow morning. So right now, there's no cause and manner of death. Investigation ongoing.